okay it's not this one okay operate do we have water injection right here so face oil just to make sure draw down pressure okay so we select this one maximum to be twenty five meter cube per day yeah this is correct the surface surface water and all right I think that's okay and then yes well bore Everything good, injected fluid water. Okay, option. All right, and layer gradient option, make sure. Okay, now I want to shut in the well after one year injection. So it's like this and option status change it to shut in apply so it's like this you see we have well injector constraint injected fluid and shut in so both the CO2 injector and the water injection well will shut in after one year of injection so click on ok very good and we can expand the co2 injector and expand the water injector it's still not okay still red flag let's go to perforation okay we will add perforation okay i want to place it at one one five wait a minute okay connected to surface good okay and then this one is one one five okay should delete this okay one one six connected to one and then add one one seven lastly one one eight okay like this and ff one okay everything good you can also add perforation using mouse like this okay okay so far so good click apply and then click on okay so you see the water injector there and if we look at the ik2d view you can see the perforation for the co2 injector there and the perforation for the water injector there now we can click save and i think we are good we will after this we will run on the gem and visualize the result using the results feature and we can also change or we can you know do perform we, we can perform sensitivity on the water injection rate for example if you want to increase the water injection rate from 25 to 50 and you can see what will happen what will change okay but now we will run the case with a 25 millimeter um, meter cube per day uh, injection rate but until then uh, see you in the next video thank you